Hello, I'm Jake Danzig and I'm making this quick little video primarily for the Wink users group. Uh, I'll probably also post it to the Southwest Arcade Collectors page as well. I just wanted to show the number one use I have for the Wink Smart Hub. Um, I do have quite a few uses for it, uh, a lot of water sensors, door sensors and such. But um, my number one use for it by far is to turn on and off all of my arcade games. Um, used to turn them, or I still actually turn them on, on and off individually uh, when I just want to play a certain game or two. However, I did just recently make a grouping for all arcade. I wasn't sure I was going to like that at first, but it turns out it actually works pretty well uh, uh, when I feel like playing a whole lot or when I'm having a bunch of people over or something. I just simply hit one button, light everything up. So anyways, how this works uh, for the people un unfamiliar with Wink, uh, it's a smart hub and you can control smart uh, outlets of ver among various other things with it. Anyways, I replaced uh, all the outlets in my arcade area with these smart outlets here. <clears throat> I'm going to do the best with this video I can. I know it's dark in here and uh, trying to make a video with the iPad of which I've never actually done before. So here's uh, one game that there's no power strip plugged into this outlet, it's just one game to it. Um, there's about 12, 13 outlets that are replaced in here, but um, most of them have power strips plugged in because there's actually about 40 machines in here total. So here is uh, just a simple outlet. Now it's got a built-in blue LED and also a button right next to it which you can use physically to uh, turn the game on and off with. However, that's uh, not what I normally use them for, so let me show you how it actually works. Turn this back off. Slide this game back in place. I'll come over here. Pull out the phone. Come on, phone. Pull up the Wink app. So you can see this here at all. Nah, it's probably not going to work in this lighting. But I'll just go ahead and uh, go to the groupings and hit the button for All Arcade. Wait a few seconds. Everything starts lighting up. Some games have to uh, have a little boot up sequence and some of the uh, power strips are actually uh, kind of smart power strips so they um, take a few seconds before they turn on so anyways that's the majority of it right there. It's a lot easier than um, going for the power switches on some of the games especially the older ones. Matter of fact, a couple of uh, much older pinball machines I have don't even have power switches. Uh, you simply uh, have to plug them in and out. So the way I have these set up is everything is plugged in and everything uh, that has a power switch has a power switch set to on. So uh, all I got to do is basically turn the outlet on and all the games will aut automatically power on. Uh, the reason I stumbled into this specific use for the Wink Hub was because of this machine right here, the jukebox. Its power switch is in a really tough spot to get to if you want to turn it on and off about every day. It's on the very back of the machine and you'd have to pull the machine out away from the wall just to try to get to the power switch and I just got kind of tired of dealing with that so went looking for a solution and uh, found the smart outlets with the Wink Hub and it's turned out so well, I liked it so much, I ended up um, utilizing that technology for the entire arcade. And there it is. Thanks for watching.